Why testing a Sigma empath is the ultimate mistake for narcissists. Hello there, minds that are curious. Have you ever wondered what it would be like to put a Sigma empath to the test? It seems as though you're pulling on a rubber band and getting closer to the breaking point. At first, it could seem unimportant as though nothing has altered. But be comfortable, something interesting is going to happen. Hold on tight. As the seconds pass, you start to feel uneasy, like there's a slight sting on your skin. These mysterious people handle life's obstacles with unmatched grace, making you feel like a small dot in the vast scheme of things. They seem to have perfected the art of quiet power, making you wonder about your own importance in their universe. Now, one may think that a Sigma empath would express regret for their acts after testing their limitations. The surprising part is that they steadfastly and unreservedly hold their ground. You could wonder, and why? That's when the mystery gets really interesting. So come along with me as we explore the world of Sigma empaths and learn why it would be a very bad idea for narcissists to test them. As you begin to reveal more about these endearing individuals, pay close attention. You won't want to miss it, I promise. Number 1. Sigma Empaths Respond to Adversity When someone attempts to play tricks on them or tamper with them, Sigma Empaths don't just take it. Nope, just what they get, they return. It's similar to holding up a mirror to the perpetrator and reflecting the same negativity back at them. It's an effective method of conveying the message. Hey, treating people badly isn't cool. In an attempt to show the other person how harmful their actions are, Sigma empaths magnify that bad energy. Instead of trying to keep the other person negative, the idea is to make them pause and consider how they are treating other people. Who knows? Maybe just maybe they will decide to change. Number 2. Sigma empaths point out improper conduct. Sigma empaths are skilled at identifying toxic individuals and calling attention to their inappropriate behavior. They make sure that people are aware of these troublemakers by using their connections and influence to alert others about them. They speak up and inform everyone of what's happening because they can't stand witnessing others be mistreated or harmed by these toxic people. And when those poisonous people are brought to light, they may feel a great deal of shame for what they did. But sometimes, even in difficult situations, you have to speak up. We can all learn what it is to be brave and speak up for what's right from Sigma empaths. Number 3. Testers feel stupid due to Sigma empaths. You wind up feeling quite ridiculous when you mess with a Sigma empath, much like when you dive headfirst into an empty pool. Sigma empaths have a talent for making the person putting them to the test feel as though they've made a grave error. It serves as a mild reminder to them that they shouldn't have bothered someone who is well-organized. Although Sigma empaths don't usually boast, they are not afraid to defend themselves when necessary. If you were in their position, would you want to put up with the foolishness of others? Instead of allowing their acts to defeat them, Sigma empaths let those who test them to suffer the consequences of their own deeds. Number 4. Sincere apologies are not easily accepted by Sigma empaths, especially. Accepting an apology can be difficult, particularly if you know the other person intended to harm you. Sigma empaths are aware that others who test them may do so with the deliberate aim to hurt them, which makes it even more difficult to forgive and move on. Sigma empaths find it difficult to accept an apology and an attempt at reconciliation from the person who started the conflict. They think there's no justification for forgiving someone who purposefully disturbed their tranquility. It's difficult to forgive someone unless there was a true error. Rather, Sigma empaths decide to let go of the negative in order to go on and discover inner peace. Number 5. Truth-Speaking Sigma Empaths Sigma empaths don't mince words when it comes to expressing their opinions. They have a talent for stating some harsh realities that could cause some pain. They seek to awaken people who are engrossed in their own small fantasy worlds with blunt facts. Sigma empaths want to pop these bubbles in order to bring people back to Earth and help them grasp life's greater purpose. Their humility and the lessons of fairness and respect for others are the main objectives. It is significantly more fruitful to assist someone in improving themselves rather than pushing them beyond their comfort zone. 
comparable to plucking fruit off a tree before it's ripe. It won't taste nice. In essence, the goal of Sigma Empaths is to demonstrate that helping and motivating others is the secret to realizing their full potential. Number six, there are boundaries even for Sigma Empaths. Contrary to popular belief, Sigma Empaths are not patient people. They may become weary of being tested constantly and alter how they react to others who push their buttons. Even while they could be understanding and nice at first, they won't hesitate to display their harsher side if you push them too far. Sigma empaths are comfortable experiencing a wide range of emotions since they are aware of their imperfections. They know that pretending everything is fine would only make them appear weak and vulnerable to being taken advantage of, so they don't disguise how they feel. It's not selfish to speak up and express oneself. Rather, it's about taking responsibility for one's own emotions and experiences. Number seven, making you feel indecent. One of the worst sensations someone may experience is believing they are unworthy of love or acceptance and that they are not good enough. Those that consistently push their boundaries tend to feel exactly that way, and Sigma empaths are adept at that. They feel it inconsiderate and even intrusive that someone would continually testing them and they are unable to comprehend why. Sigma empaths may make these pushy people feel unworthy by pointing out the negative effects of their behavior in an attempt to make them realize how wrong their actions are. Although it may sound severe, Sigma empaths view it as a way of imparting some difficult life lessons. They want these people to know that they are not the center of the universe and that things do not go around them. These difficult lessons are what allow people to develop and increase their self-awareness. Number eight, acquiring the ability to let go. Empaths who are sigmas are well-versed at taking a step back and disengaging from the outside world. It's similar to pausing social interactions and separating oneself from people who don't respect them or other people. They preserve their inner serenity and give priority to their well-being by taking this break. In calm environments, Sigma empaths allow themselves the opportunity to recover and achieve serenity. Someone is effectively shut off if they have crossed their boundaries too often. It sounds like the pushy people are being permanently removed from their lives, and they won't be hearing from Sigma empaths again. Since people who continued to test them never truly believed in them in the first place, Sigma empaths strongly think that it's best to let them go and move on. Number 9. Influence and Strategic Adaptation To maneuver through difficult situations, Sigma empaths use a special combination of strategic manipulation and reflecting mirroring. Through deftly mimicking and gently swaying the actions of others, they effectively guide troublemakers toward congruence with their own goals. Although people being controlled may find this tactic unsettling at first, the Sigma empath can use it as a powerful tool to establish control and promote happy relationships. Number 10. Demonstrating authority with honor. Sigma empaths project a shield of superiority when they are around narcissists. This posture communicates resiliency and confidence while acting as a strong shield against abuse and manipulation. It also makes it very evident that respect is something that must be earned via deeds of kindness and sincerity. By using this strategy, Sigma empaths force narcissists to understand how important it is to behave respectfully if they want to continue being in their lives. I'd love to know which strategy you think works best for revealing hidden potential before we wrap up. Post your thoughts in the space provided for comments below. Please remember to hit the notification bell, subscribe to our channel, and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and would like to see more like it. That way you won't miss any updates. Don't forget to read the free book and think about scheduling a private consultation by clicking the link in the description. We are so grateful for your involvement and support, which enables us to keep offering our community insightful information. I appreciate you watching and see you later.